Does it matter? Calm down. And you just address me as a, I'm a grown man, okay? I'm not no child. Do I make myself I, clear? Did, did I say you were a child? Did Do I make myself clear? Did I say you were a child, deputy? I'm supposed to carry ID everywhere I go? Yeah, you're supposed to, yeah. What, yes, law, you what law is that? Oh, you, do you know it's a 9-11? You know, we had a right to ID anybody? Like no, that's wrong. Remember that. You came up to me. Shut up. You shut up. <laughs> he is mad. This is not a public meeting. You can put the camera down and you can leave. Where's the transparency? Two choices. Two choices. Put the camera down or leave. I don't have any reason to be in that board meeting. It says public meeting here. Let me see it. Don't snatch from me. What do you think you're doing? Hey, what's up guys? Long Island Audit here. Back again with another video. Today we're at the Soto County Office Building here in the great state of Mississippi. We are here today to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to film in public and publicly accessible areas to promote transparency and accountability within our government and to ensure that our public servants respect our rights and treat us with respect. Let's get into it. DeSoto County Administration Building. Here goes our friendly reminders that they're always recording us. Even though it always seems to be an issue when we record them. Go figure. Looks like there's an officer coming up to me right now. Hey, how are you? What are you looking for? What's your name? Can I get your name and badge number first? No, what's your name? Can I get your name and badge number first? I mean, what, what's your name? I'm just asking you for your name and badge number, sir. No, I mean, you see, what would share the problem? So, I mean, why? Okay, since you don't want to provide it, it's Kizart? No, it's not my name. That's not your name, Kizart? Mm -hmm. How do you say it then? My name is Deputy Kizart. What's oh, your name? Oh, Kizart. And your badge number? His art. I mean, why all that? Just so I know who I'm talking to. You came up to me. Oh, it's the only one. I mean, I'm just wondering why you're coming to a film there. But that's what I'm saying. What is your state your business? Oh, my business? I'm just taking pictures and video. What's, well, what, what's the purpose? I'm an independent journalist. I'm just taking some pictures and video. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wait, do you have any ID on me? Do I have any ID on me? Yes, sir. No, I don't have any ID on me, no. You don't? Mm -hmm. Why not? I don't, I don't carry ID everywhere I go. But you know you're supposed to, right? I'm supposed to carry ID everywhere I go? Yeah, you're supposed to, yeah. What, law, what law is that? Oh, you, do you know it's a 9-11? You know, we have a right to ID anybody? That like no, you? that's wrong. You're wrong about that. That's not true. You need reasonable, you need what's called reasonable articulable suspicion that I'm committing a crime yeah. in order to lawfully demand ID from me. Mm -hmm. And I don't have to carry ID. I mean, if I didn't have ID, then you can demand name and date of birth, but again, I'm, you would need... I'm not finna go back and forth with you, like, I'm... So I'm why come up to me in the beginning? Well, so why are you walking through a public building just filming people? You said it right, Deputy. Public building. You said it right. Alright. Don't be a tyrant, Deputy. He tried to take a picture of me, <laughs> but the door is closed on him. Would you like me to smile, Kizart? I'll smile for you. No big deal. Hi, ma'am. How are you? Good. How are you doing today, Deputy? Good, and you? I'm doing well. I was just explaining to uh, Deputy Kizart over here mm -hmm. um, what I was doing. I'll take another picture. Go ahead. All you want. As many as you'd like. 
Would you? Are you? What's your uh, name and badge number, sir? I don't. I'm not gonna talk. Hold me. You don't have any. Are you a sh Are you, you a sheriff? Are you the sheriff here? Okay. Well, that's not very professional, sir. So it goes from the top down, huh? That's the sheriff. Is that where you learned how to be unprofessional? Is that what you learned, sir? You just one of them gags, right? One of the, you could have identified yourself the you same way anybody gags, else. So I'm just recording. You just was you recording me. I mean, that's fine. You can do that all you want. I don't care. You look childish. I'm a grown man. But you look you childish by recording me. Is that a personal phone or a work phone? Why? Does it matter? Calm down. And you just address me as a, I'm a grown man, okay? I'm not no child. Do I make myself I, clear? Did, did I say you were a child? Did Do I make myself clear? Did I say you were a child, deputy? Acting like a... Acting like a child. That's, that's what I said. Correct. That's what I said. If you're going to accuse me of something, let's make sure it's right. Yeah, okay. All right? I see the, uh, the professionalism or lack thereof comes from the top down. That looked like the sheriff there, because he was in the board, he was in the meeting over there, so. You keep coming back and looking at me all you want. You don't intimidate me. Not even a little bit. Yeah, keep on recording me, go ahead. That's your constitutional right, deputy. Just record each other then. That's fine with me. Obviously I not. Paid, I get paid to do this. Oh, you do? I'll find out how much. Yeah. Kids are, right? More than you ever think. Okay. More than I think. You came up to me, deputy. Remember that. Remember that. You came up to me. You shut up. <laughs> he is mad. Shut up. Wow. What is up with these people here in Mississippi, man? What is wrong with them? Jesus. That's crazy. I don't treat anybody with disrespect unless they disrespect me, and that's exactly what he did. No, sir. I'm okay. Thank you. Okay. You work here? In, in what capacity? Uh, well, what, 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 uh, what, what are you doing here today? Oh, no, I just wanted to know if, if you said you could, if you asked me if I needed any help, so I wanted yeah. to know who you are, so maybe you could help me. I don't yeah. know. I got you. Okay. Yeah. I see you're filming. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. That's for sure. Yeah. So, yeah, I can help you, though. I work for the local government here. You work for so the local service in what In what capacity? For? So I can. Is, uh, I'm the director of environmental services. Okay. Parks and Greenways. Okay. Um. See? I don't think there's anything you can help me out with. Okay. That's why I asked just for your, you know, your title. So I know I maybe you. could have been the director of law enforcement and I could have. Oh, no. no. I could have uh, talked to you or something, no, you know. There's, there's could a have lot been of the people in charge of uh, law enforcement around here. Oh, okay. Yeah, just making I, just, sure. I saw you here filming something, so I thought maybe you're looking yeah, I'm for just something. Taking, no, I'm just taking a little tour of the, the county building here. Okay. I'm an independent journalist. I'm just gathering. Yeah, I'm just okay. gathering some content for a story. That's all. Okay. I yeah. got you. What, what website? Independent journalist? Oh, I don't want to disclose because I'm not done with the story yet. Oh, but okay. if well, you want to I give did, me an email, I can well, email you. Well, I disclosed to you. my position to you, so why don't you disclose your position to me? Uh, yeah, no, I, I don't think it works that way. You're in public service, sir. And you asked, I didn't come up to you saying, hey, can I help you with something, sir? Right. right. Uh, anytime anyone is in our building, mm -hmm. and if they're a citizen, then we want to we want to help them in any way. That yeah, they can. and I appreciate, and I can totally appreciate that. And so I are do. You a citizen of Minnesota County, and I do appreciate that. I don't answer any questions as far as my personal life. I just don't okay. do it. Uh, but, right, but so you can't answer my question if you're a citizen of Minnesota County. I just don't. I don't answer any any questions. Okay, any, but I any, answered your questions. Well, again, two things. Again, you came up to me asking if I needed any help. Right. That's right. The second thing is you're in public service, and I'm not. I'm an independent journalist. I right. like to keep my information private. That's right. all. Okay. Nothing, no, no, nothing uh, well, nefarious glad, going I'm on glad here. I didn't do that to you. Uh, that that was kind of rude for you not to answer my question. I, so, I did. I, I you told me what your job title was. Right. I told you what my job title I, was. I just like to know: Are you a citizen of Desoto County? I understand what you'd like. I I get that 100. percent I okay. do. 
I just so don't. Are you? <laughs> sir, I just told you I don't answer any uh, private information questions at no, all. That's not private information. That's, it is. That's it's public, my public knowledge. I mean, if it's public like knowledge, if it's public knowledge, then like, then you'll be name? you'll be able to get it. I didn't what's get your name, your name either. Uh, yes, I, I disclosed my name. Oh, I didn't catch it. Yeah, yeah, it's it's on it's on video there. Okay. So so yeah so so again, is there something I can help you with? No, no, no. Uh, again, no. Again, okay. I, I don't need any help with anything. Like I just told you, mm -hmm. um, I'm an independent journalist. Just taking some pictures and video here of the county building. Okay. That's all. I don't need any okay. specific help. No, definitely yeah. not with environmental services. <laughs> right. You don't think that's kind of strange that you're walking around a public building, film, film, you know, video and everything? Do I think it's strange? Yeah. No, not at all. Okay. I, I don't. I do. I do. You think the freedom of press is strange? Uh, no, absolutely not. The First but Amendment. Since you can't tell me what press you're affiliated with, mm -hmm. then I'm not sure you're really press. Oh no, sir. You yeah, missed, I need you're... to know your name yeah. and, and the press that you work for. Then, mm -hmm. then perhaps we could uh, see that you're legitimately someone from the press oh, and yeah. not someone here intending to do something that would come to harm some of our citizens or our people here working. Yeah, no, I, so, I could so I could please under, understand I could understand, understand that. I could I could understand that, but you know, I think you're just a little misinformed. You know, no, just, I, I'm not misinformed. Yeah, just a little bit because you, you don't have me any information. No, no, so no. I can't be misinformed. <laughs> No, you're a little bit misinformed on what is classified as, as the press. You know, really? CNN, MSNBC, mm -hmm. Fox News. Yeah, those are those are press agencies, but we have freedom of the press, meaning that every single person, including yourself, sir, mm -hmm. has freedom of the press. Mm -hmm. So if you would like to be a news gatherer and you'd like to work for your own company, you would be press. There define, is, define press for me. Press is any citizen mm -hmm. who goes out there and news gathers. Oh, that's, and that's what's and, in the encyclopedia? And, and distributes. Oh, the dictionary, excuse and, and it That's what's in the dictionary? Disseminating public, disseminating right. information to the public. Sir. Well, also, in today's world, we oh, have to Oh, here we go, sure, in today's world. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> here we, we have go. to make sure that we're safe. Mm -hmm. And I don't we, think you think you're not safe, sir. Because if you, you if you thought you weren't safe, let's be fair, you wouldn't be talking to me for this don't long. Don't put words in my mouth. Don't put you words wouldn't, in my mouth. You would not, you would not be talking I to me for this long. I appreciate If you. I'm scared of somebody, I don't go up to them, right? I appreciate you, what you're trying to say, but don't put words in my mouth. I'm okay? just saying, you don't, you don't, you don't seem, okay. No, you don't sir. seem as though you're scared. I, I'm here to find out why you're wandering around this building mm -hmm. filming the building. And I just told that you. That could be perceived as someone perhaps planning to do something that that would be a security breach around here. I'm sure there's so, a million reasons why somebody would walk around the building recording. No, sure. there's not. There's sure. not. I've been in this building for about 17 years. Okay. And, it's a long uh, time. Yeah. No one has ever been around here video in this building. Really? There's cameras all over the place. The cameras you, are internal cameras. They're, no, they're public record. They are still internal cameras. But they're public record. I didn't say they were. Anybody can get anybody can get that footage. That's right. That'd probably be the smarter way. Instead of you know coming out to the public building and showing your face all over the place, the right. smarter way would be to anonymously get the public records, mm -hmm. and then you get the layout of the building well, that you way. You have to fill out a public records request. Yeah, I mean, but you don't so, have to show ID. So my whole my whole point is, I hope you see that what you're doing could be a cause of concern around here. For, for the employees who work here and for the people who enter and exit through this building. Yeah. It could be a huge concern. I don't I don't see how that's a concern, especially when I'm talking to you. I'm it's literally like, I'm you're, you're I'm literally sitting here me, talking to you. You won't tell me who you are and yeah. and, and what pressure I value you. my privacy, sir. Okay. I that's value all. I value the safety of the public. And I can assure you that there you're not there's a deputy right behind you. Yeah. Yeah. There's a there's a there's a deputy right behind I you. Just, he won't tell me his name or, or who he, what what uh, his did you know is. did you know that the deputy wouldn't even tell me his name what's the difference the deputy wouldn't tell me his name okay, well, his some people about he he must value privacy his name's on his shirt so. yeah okay yeah do you not understand what's going on with, do you not understand what's going on now? well i just told him that you know he he could be perceived that it's a safety issue around exactly. here yeah and uh, he don't want he don't want to be perceived as that cuz we going to deal with that accordingly. Excuse me? <laughs> Excuse right. me? Is he video me? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm video I'm video everybody. About 20 minutes or so. But he won't tell me his name or what independent press. Well, we've got, or we've got oh, something confidential going on right here. So can you all move it down there? Okay. I'd be happy to. Okay. Yeah.
Mm. Or if you're yeah. in line for this, you can sit in the I, office. I have been in line. You've already been in there? there? Yeah. I'm, you're going to handle it. How are you going to do that, deputy? How are you going to do that? I don't think you, I don't think you could. I don't think you could. Easy. Wow. What an unprofessional law enforcement officer. He better hope he's not a security threat because we're going to handle that accordingly. All tough. <laughs> oh, man. Can you do anything about what? Yeah. About me? Yeah. Exercising a constitutional right? One of the guys who exercises a constitutional right. There you go. One of those guys. What disrespect by a public servant. Yeah, you do. You're in public, and you're a public employee. Let's see if this meeting over here is open to the public. This is a public meeting, no? No, sir. No, no video. You can put the camera down or you can leave. So there's no... You can put the camera down and you can leave. This is not a public meeting? You can put the camera down and you can leave. Where's the transparency? Two choices. Two choices. Put the camera down or leave. Where's the transparency? Outside. Interesting. Where's the transparency, Sheriff? Interesting. I thought it was a public meeting. I have to contact these supervisors here and hold them accountable for kicking me out of a public meeting because I'm recording. That's ridiculous. I'll take one of these. Kicked out of a public meeting for a little transparency. Well, I doubt People are going to be very happy about that. Kids are, you're just going to follow me around all day? Sir, the board meeting is not open to the public. You do not have any reason to be in that board meeting. It says public meeting here. Let me see it. Don't snatch from me. What do you think you're doing? Don't snatch something from me. What do you think you're doing? Grab your own copy, all right? What's wrong with you, man? You got a bad attitude. You don't deserve to wear the badge. You don't deserve it. We have, we have a gentleman over here that's walking and giving the chief come up with it tonight. He's just recording and talking. He, he, he said he's a journalist and uh, he's just recording. He's recording me as you speak now. And uh, he's just at the board. This, guy is, this guy's a loose cannon right here. Kizard over here is a loose cannon. Yeah, I know. You're a loose cannon, Kizart. You know that? I'm glad I came here today, and I'm glad I got to expose you to the world. Glad. What a tyrant this guy is. Next time when somebody comes in here, you treat him with respect. You identify yourself. You hear me? Next time somebody comes in here and asks for your name and badge number, you give it to them. You be cordial. You be, profe you be professional. You be professional. You learn the law. You learn the law. 9-11 didn't mean you could do whatever you want to do. Learn the law. Yeah, keep telling me to shut up. You're a class act. Class act you are. Because I'm trying to educate you. I'm trying to educate you. You can't, you can't act the way you do. You can't, you can't, you can't treat. You can't treat people. You can't treat people however way you want, Kizart. You can't do that. 
Your job is to be professional with the public, professional with the public. De-escalate the situation, not escalate it. Not, not you know, record me like a little child and put your hand everywhere. Come on, man. You got to be better than that. The taxpayers fund your, po- fund your salary. You got to be better than that, kids are. I'm going to give you the opportunity to apologize to me for the way you treated me here today, kids are. I shouldn't hold my breath. <laughs> you said I shouldn't hold my breath for an apology? Yeah, you did. It's on camera, man. Now you're a liar. Come on, man. Don't do that. Let's leave here as a mutual understanding that you should treat the public better and you should learn the law. And then... I just told you, I'm an, I told you from the, get, from the get-go, I'm an independent journalist. This is my work. This is my work. You, you made yourself the star for the world to see. For what? For what? I wasn't disrespectful towards you. I didn't try and snatch nothing out your hand. What did I do to you, Kizar? What did I do to you? You want to tell me, you want to, tell me to shut up and be rude? For what? Professionalism. Professionalism. Be professional. I'm done with this guy. Take care, Deputy Kizart. Before I leave, this is your last opportunity to apologize to me and the public for your disgraceful behavior here today. Would you like to take me up on that opportunity, sir? To apologize to the public for your disgraceful behavior here? As well as myself? No? All right, well, have the day you deserve. All right, guys, we're going to be getting out of here. Deputy Kizard over here, tyrant, doesn't want to apologize for his disgraceful behavior here today. So, because he doesn't just owe me an apology, he owes all of you an apology for putting on this, the people of this county an apology for having, look at him, he won't stop. He just won't stop, will you? Call me stupid, tell me to shut up. Things I never told him. Such a beautiful building. Such ugly people inside of it, though. <laughs> right, kids are. All right, guys. So we're just getting out of the Soto County office building here in Mississippi. Wow, that was definitely a fail. Such passive-aggressive public servants, Deputy Kizart, just. Plain unprofessional, childish behavior. It, it, it never ceases to amaze me. Why would you act that way and behave that way on camera? Like, it doesn't make any sense to me. Why would you want the world, or anyone for that matter, to see you acting in such a childish manner, an unprofessional manner? You are a public servant, took an oath to uphold the Constitution. 9-11 didn't end the Constitution. Just because 9-11 happened doesn't mean that you can demand ID and force people to give you ID. That's not how that works, Deputy Kizard. Treat the members of the public with respect. Ridiculous behavior. Even from his chief. The chief, completely unprofessional, asked his name and badge number. He's like, I'm not dealing with you. I'm not giving you anything. Of course, it goes from the top down. That's where Deputy Kizart learned his unprofessional tyrant behavior. And then the chief kicking me out of a public meeting simply because I was recording. I'm gonna hold those supervisors in that meeting accountable. I will. I'll be writing emails to all of them. Wait till they see this video and see how badly they performed on this audit. The director of environmental whatever, you know, wants to try and play psychological games with me. Like, just ridiculous. That I'm a threat, I'm in his building. This is not your building. I don't care if you've been here for 17 years, 20 years, 30 years. This is the people's building. I have a right to news gather inside of it. I have a right to be here. Ridiculous. And thankfully, the chief at least knew that. At, at the very least. But Officer Kizart, you will go down as the infamous deputy here on this audit because of your childish, unprofessional, 
unconstitutional behavior here. But anyways, guys, let me know what you think about this one in the comment section below. As always, stay safe. God bless. I'll see you in the next video. Long Island Audit. Peace.